All right, these are the 10 most dangerous gangs in East LA. East LA consists of three sections, Boyo Heights, Lincoln Heights, El Sereno, no specific order. Let's get into it. First, we got Primera Flats. Now, Primera Flats got two sections. They got First Street and they got the flip side. They got a lot of young members over there that's catching bodies. I'm talking about teenagers with a few bodies. They starting out real young over there. There's an apartment complex in this neighborhood. You're gonna see that in American Me. A lot of these Mexican gangs actually do have different races in them. Blacks, whites, Armenians. Despite what you think, they can be open-minded. Next, we got Big Hazard Trece. Now this hood right here is said to be the hit squad for the Mexican Mafia. Yeah, they earned that. This neighborhood right here also inspired American Me as well. This set right here produces a lot of high-ranking members for the Mexican Mafia. These guys stay indicted. Next, we got Evergreen Trece. Evergreen Trece's had a lot of members killed by Primera Flats. That's why they at war. And one thing about Evergreen Trece, they actually had a black shot caller at one point. He was killed by crazy-ass Mexicans. That's another gang. Next crazy ass mexicans they actually started out as a tagging crew a lot of these gonna start out a tagging crews party crews and then they're gonna turn into gangs this was one of them when they were a tagging crew they started getting bigger and taking over territories that's how they turned into a gang see they got a stricter program on their youngins though so you're gonna see other gangs starting them out early 14 13 even 12 right there start catching bodies around 16 17 not too early next we got tiny boys Trece. Now, sometimes they go by trophy boys or shy rat because they off of chicago street this set right here is known to recruit a lot of tagging crews and get their numbers up. This set right here actually deleted one of the Primera Flats. That's why they at war. Next, we got Clica Los Primos. Now, the ones that started this were cousins from a Latin King set from Wimberwood Gardens. Broke off from that and they started this. And despite what anybody thinks, there are Latin Kings in California. They don't run like the Chicago and the New York ones. They run under the 13, but they are here in Anaheim, Pasadena, Fontana, and more. Next, we got White Fence. White Fence is one of the oldest and most well respected gangs in East LA. They always gonna have some active members no matter what. That's never gonna be a problem. They probably got one of the biggest and longest beefs in Southern Cali history. I would say the world, Craig, but I don't know. The group they've been at war with, the Maravillas. Now the thing about the Maravillas is they're Southsiders, but they're not Sureños. They got a green light on them. What that means is anything with the 13 on it, that's their enemy. But the Maravillas is a group of different sections of Maravillas, but I'm gonna count them all as one. In there, you got Lopez Maravilla, Gage Maravilla Arifa, Pomeroy Maravilla, Hoyo Maravilla, Ford Maravilla, Fraser Maravilla, Mariana Maravilla, Arizona Maravilla, and the Maravilla Projects. Again, Southsiders and not Sureños. Remember that. Next, we got Garrity Loma Trece. Now, this set right here is in the hills of East LA. They got windy roads and them hills. They use that to their advantage when their enemies try to come for them. They do them little ambush tactics. Be careful for them on the hills. And last on the list, we got East Lake Locos Trece. Now, this set right here actually started out as a football team slash crew back in the day, but they were surrounded by so many gangs, they had to jump in the mix. You'll even see this neighborhood right here in the movie Training Day very active section. Hispanics are very low key and they got a strict program. Shout out to all the Mexicans. These are some honorable mentions right here because we didn't forget y'all neither. Los Angeles is broken up into many different areas. This right here is strictly East LA. That's Boyle Heights, Lincoln Heights, El Sereno, the Mexicans.